Well, hey everyone, welcome back to Winterfell Camp. It's still April the 4th. Snowstorm's still going on. Anyways, I went outside and got the wood. Sitting here, uh, it's actually drying up really fast. It's really dry wood. It was a little damp, but uh, anyways, um, it's three in the almost three o'clock this afternoon, and I thought, well, you know what? I'm gonna at least prepare the stove for uh, you know lighting it up. It's minus two Celsius outside, so it's like okay, and it's not gonna get any warmer. And you know, even though if it says uh, minus minus one. Um, Outside, this is Lanark Highlands, as I've constantly reminded you people, so everything's always colder, snowier than what they call for, so, uh, or what the, they call it on the Weather Channel, so, anyway, so I'm just pre-preparing, uh, uh, my fire, I do it the same way, I do the, it's like a, what do they call it, a cabin fires, you know, uh, to start the fire build a little cabin and then put your you know, your wood so I don't mind using up this this stuff here I buy from Canadian Tire so I won't have to do that after this year so I'll be making tons of my own kindling and uh, there we go um, I remember where my uh, oh yeah See, then I just throw uh, one of these here. I cheat. Uh, I mean, I got paper put aside, but these are so cheap now, and it's so easy. You just toss it in. Whoop, toss it in there. And when you're ready to ready to go, you know, I light it up. Then I put the other piece of uh, kindling on it, and then I throw my regular wood on top. So, um, which in this case is going to be. It'll be these smaller ones to start with. Uh, maybe this will be dry enough too. No, it's still pretty damp. That may not dry in time. I was going to use that bark. But anyways, uh, these here... Okay, dum-dum. These here, these smaller ones, they dry up quickly even sitting in here. I mean, they're not green. They're just because it was, you know, wet outside before they were stacked and everything. It was raining yesterday. So anyways, what I'll do is I'll put those on. They're sitting here in the, like even these bigger ones have already dried out. They were, you know, wet when I brought them in. So anyways, uh, so I, I'll put those on top once uh, I'm ready to light the uh, the fire starter. And uh, she'll take right off. That's how I do it. Uh, rocket science, that's for sure. I call that a cabin fire. That's how I start my outdoor fires too. I mean, it's uh, it's uh, it never fails. So, and uh, like I say, I right now I'm just buying that that kindling Easy Flame, it's called or whatever they call themselves. Anyways, uh, um, Wally's not happy about something. What's your problem there? Bingo. Hey, eh? what's your problem? Oh, gnarly today. You know what it is. They want me to start the fire, eh? Hey, Wally, is that what you want? You want me to start the fire, eh? Yeah, you guys want the warm. Goldie's smart. She, where I sit there, is probably warm. So she's like, I get in there while it's still warm. Look at him just marching right off like, fuck you, he's saying. Blackie, quietly and patiently waiting for the fire to be started. <laughs> His spot. They uh, they now they wrestle over that spot. It's not serious fighting. If it was, I you know you could tell the difference. But it's like, uh, what is that cat doing now? Are you kneading in my beach? Yeah, he was. He was kneading on my beach. Uh, the, Norm gave that to me. Um, it's a snap-on tool. Uh, uh, not blanket. Towel. I don't like to wait. Okay, I thought he was going to go piss or something there. Oh, he's kneading. I think I've never seen him do that before. Sorry about the underwear and the... <laughs> oh, yeah, he's uh, he's pissed. What's your problem, Wally? Sorry about the dirty underwear, guys. Oh, well. Realistic. <laughs> I think it's uh, 
coming apart and then uh, now this storm showed up so laundry is currently on hold so i've got it the washing machine situated out here out of the way i got the chair back there so anyways as soon as all this disappears here um wally come on wally he doesn't want me near him and then he won't get then i can't get rid of him so anyway nothing's changed here so anyway I, this was just a quickie i wanted to show you uh, how i prepped the fire uh i already you know do that out there well not a billion oh maybe a billion most people don't live like us here in north america mostly a lot of them in, my, in, the, in the colder climates they live around fires so check out our friends in the north siberia too places like that no fire no living so that's pretty much, and they do it totally different than we do, but they're facing minus 80 Celsius, you know, like, eh. anyways. All right, so there you go. Wood stove. Wow, wasn't that interesting? <laughs> Please like, share, and subscribe. Uh, okay, I'll finish this at seven minutes, so now i got to say a bunch of stuff here. Okay, well, on this one here, I'm also on Rumble, uh, www.rumble.com slash c slash lad from the woods um that's the one that i put exclusive stuff that i can't put on youtube or youtube has told me that well we're gonna we give you a warning like they did on this last one so i pretty know now which ones i'm not going to put on youtube so they'll be exclusive on rumble so if you want to see those you're going to have to go over there um alternatively i guess i could put them on patreon but i do different stuff for patreon and i haven't done that much video anyway so there you go if you, uh, please, uh, please like share and subscribe that's the biggest thing man you do that the video gets into a algorithm whether youtube likes it or not people start watching so like i say and we just need cool people we don't need a million people just cool people okay everyone see you later be good to your fellow human peace live long and prosper